Now, ABC6 News at Noon, on your side. New information right now on a husband and wife who fought back against an intruder in their house. Now, we now know their granddaughter ran for help during the home invasion in Pataskala early this morning. Good Day Columbus first broke the story for you. And ABC6 reporter Mike McCarthy is there live with just how seriously this couple was hurt, Mike. Well, Pete, right now the husband is being treated for cuts to his face and his head at a Columbus hospital. His wife is there visiting him. Meanwhile, the armed man who came into their house early this morning, well, he's still on the run. One police car didn't get much attention, but the parade on Eden Dairy Lane sure got neighbors like Kenny Hoying. We were alarmed. Worried. Woke up to a text message from a friend neighbor across the way who said uh, there's been an incident. Pataskala police say a husband and wife were attacked after an early morning break-in. We found one male bloodied, uh, apparently beaten up. The family didn't want to talk on camera, but the wife told me she woke up to a masked man beating her husband with a gun in their bed. She says she was then dragged by her hair to the kitchen where the burglar got cash and left. Police say the couple's young teenage granddaughter was also home. She ran to a neighbor's for help. Officers set up a perimeter but found no suspects. The wife says she didn't hear her dogs give any warning, and investigators won't speculate on whether or not the intruder may have known anything about the victims. We're not sure why or if uh, the assailant was known or unknown at this point. The questions kept neighbors concerned. I'm shocked. I, I couldn't believe it would happen here. Even after the parade of police left. It's sad. Neighbors using words like sad and scary this afternoon to describe the situation. The wife told me she has no idea who that intruder was. Police say her husband is expected to make at least a physical recovery to his injuries. The couple says they are considering now adding security cameras to their home and they are not the only ones taking new actions. Police also changing their plans here in Pataskala.